hi guys welcome back to my channel so this is the third video in the series and in my previous video we talked about the numerical data type in python okay so in this one basically we are going to discuss the operator precedence and the associativity concept okay so before starting that let's discuss one thing that is expression so we'll see what expression is okay so expression is a combination of values variable operators and function calls okay that can be evaluated to produce a result and expression can be as simple as a single value or variable or it can be a complex combination of multiple components okay so here are the some of the examples so if you see this one so this is a arithmetic expression okay so if you see here we have uh, some combination of numbers and operators arithmetic operator so we call it as a arithmetic expression okay so next one is very simple that is variable assignment so it is also one kind of expression then we have a function call okay it's also one of the expression then we have a logical expression where if you can see there are some uh, logical conditions are there okay uh, like greater than or less than okay so this is also one kind of expression so this is just a brief about the expression because we are going to see uh, these expression in the operator precedence okay so now coming back to the operator precedence okay so operator precedence determines the order in which operators are evaluated in an expression okay so now you would have an idea what expression is okay so in an expression we can have a combination of values variables and operators okay so if we have operators in an expression then there should be some way through which we can determine which of the operation will be performed first correct so that is where we have this operator precedence concept okay and python follows a specific set of rules to determine the precedence of operators okay and understanding these precedence is crucial to uh, write correct and meaningful expressions okay so if you look at the screen so here you can see all the operators and their precedence as well and also you can see the associativity column as well okay so associativity is nothing but it determines the order in which operators of the same pre precedence are evaluated when they appear consecutively in an expression okay so let's take an example here if you see we have some numbers where we have only plus operators okay so as we already know in in previous if you would have taken the screenshot and if you have uh, looked at the screen so addition operator has left associativity okay so it will start evaluating from the left hand side so 10 will be added to 5 then 15 will be added to 2 okay so likewise we perform these operations so based on the operator precedence and the associativity these expression are being evaluated okay so now let's see some more example to understand uh, these operator precedence in a greater detail so if you see this one so here we have a combination of addition and multiplication with some values and here if you see uh, if you see here the multiplication has the higher precedence correct as compared to addition so first a multiplication will happen that will result into uh, like 4 into 5 it will be 20 and then addition will be performed 20 plus 3 that is 23 okay so this is the simpler one then uh, this is the next one so here we have parenthesis as well and parenthesis has the highest precedence as if you would have seen the screen before so it has a highest precedence so here uh, first the expression within the uh, parenthesis will be executed or will be uh, performed so 3 plus 4 will be 7 then 7 will, will be multiplied by 5 okay now uh, if you see this one so this is the exponential and exponential has right to left associativity so what we are doing here is so this is 2 to the power of 3 and 3 to the power of 2 so 
in order to evaluate these so this evaluation will happen from right to left so from right to left in the sense so first 3 to the power of 2 will be figured out that is 9 okay then it will become 2 to the power of 9 okay so 2 to the power of 9 will be 512 okay so this is one of the example where we have the right to left associativity okay similarly if we uh, see this one so here we are assigning a value okay to a variable okay so this is also one of the example where we have a right to left associativity so here if you see 10 will be assigned to c variable first then again the value that is there in c will be assigned to b and whatever value is there in b will be assigned to a so here we have a right to left associativity okay so so this is the more complex one if you see here we have a combination of parenthesis division and the modulus operator and these are all left associative okay so uh, since parenthesis has the highest uh, precedence that will be evaluated first so a plus v will be evaluated first uh, okay and then it will be divided by c okay then next a modulus c will be evaluated okay so whatever result we have got from this this one and a modulus c will be subtracted okay so yeah this was the more complex one so yeah that's all guys i wanted to cover i think you would have got an idea about the operator precedence and the associativity uh, do take a screenshot of those uh, uh, operator precedences and these examples so that you can refer it later so that is what i wanted to cover in this video and stay tuned on my channel so there will be some more uh, good uh, content i will be uploading in future Thank you guys.